Hi guys, I'm Tana. You've probably seen me around YouTube before if you like watching DIY videos. Um, I mean, if you haven't, then you're probably not subscribed, so you should go ahead and subscribe if you're new, if you haven't seen my videos before. This would be a good time to do it. So yeah, today I'm going to show you my monthly favorites. I wanted to do this favorites video because I've been getting a lot of questions on my Instagram about my hair, my skin, my jewelry, just like everything. So I wanted to show you guys the products I've been loving and the things that I use like all the time. So my like all time favorite stuff. This month I've been in the gym every single day, sometimes twice a day, and I've just been kind of getting into that whole healthy lifestyle thing. I feel like one of the reasons why I hadn't been able to stick to it before is because I kind of felt like, ah, oh, healthy food is so boring. Like, I don't want to just eat like celery and carrots. Like, sometimes you just want that variety. Like, you want chips and candy or like chocolate. So this month I got a love with food box and it basically just comes with a bunch of healthy snacks. It's only like $9.99 and you get it delivered straight to your door. So like literally it was sitting out there by my door. The snacks that they put in here, I'm not kidding guys, they're delicious and they keep me from like snacking on like Doritos or whatever. Like I feel like I can still be like a normal person while eating healthy because I can still have like chips. Um, each one of the boxes you get will come with eight different snacks in it at least per month. And one of my favorite ones was the sweet corn better chips. These were super good and I think they're vegan. Yeah, and I've been trying to kind of like ease into that vegan lifestyle so it's good to like know snacks that you like that are vegan the granola cookies that they had in here were really good this month and like i said it's like you can still be eating a cookie it's just like a cookie that's better for you so i got this box and i also got the deluxe one the deluxe one's obviously like a lot bigger and this came with more of my like favorite chips i saved the packaging but i ate them all they had a jalapeno flavor which is oh my god you guys that was the best these little puffy things. I feel like I was eating like um, Cheetos puffs and it tasted really good. But again, like nothing is like artificial. There's no artificial flavors or colors or anything like that. And I like that it comes with this little um, pamphlet and it tells you like which ones are vegan, dairy free, gluten free, and non GMO. Um, so you know. The snacks in here have helped me to seriously stay on track and like feel like a normal human being. Like I'm not just eating like celery all day long. If you really like one of the items, you can go back to their online shop and then order it and it gives you free shipping. So it's really cool. So I'm probably gonna go order these jalapeno chips and if one of your New Year's resolutions was to help out a charity It's great because love with food donates a meal for every time you order a box and they've given out like 700,000 meals already So honestly, it's a really good cause you get some healthy snacks help you stay on track with your diet So it's a win-win situation. I love that like I said, it's $9.99 Which isn't bad at all and I have a coupon code linked below where you guys can get 40% off a regular box or you can get 50% off their gluten-free boxes. So check out the links down there. I'm gonna have all my products and everything listed down below along with all the favorites and stuff I talk about in the video. So along with like health and fitness, like I have been doing, like I just feel like glowy and happy. I've noticed that my skin just like glows. Like I feel so pretty and I feel like light and airy and breezy and like, I don't know. It's not just working out. I've actually been using some new skincare products and I love them. So I had to tell you guys about them in this video. So, okay, this first one. Oh my god, this is the Kiehl's Creme de Corps, and I've heard like so many people talk about this, but I just like never wanted to pay this much for a body butter, but this one is whipped, and it's milk and honey. Oh my god, this literally, I put this on my feet the first night, and my feet felt like I got a pedicure, like it's that good. I rub this over my entire body every time I get out of the shower. Um, normally, okay, Glam Glow is another favorite, and I've talked about this before probably, and you guys like have probably heard about this a zillion times, but it's how I use it. So I don't use this like every day or anything like that or even like oh two times a week i just use this on days when i know i'm going like somewhere important the next day so if you have like a job interview if you have class picture day if you have like something that you want your skin to look really nice for use this the night before or even like right before you do your makeup i've done that too and it makes your skin like it sucks out all the oil like if you're oily like me um and it just leaves your skin looking so much nicer and your pores are tight and just like i just love this it's really good and then the keels midnight recovery i just take it it's a little bit of a dropper thing and i use this at night um not every night only when i feel like i want to wake up like refreshed or like if I have something big that day so it's like a it says it's supposed to visibly restore the appearance of skin by morning and I feel like it definitely does that like I just wake up my skin feels soft and I don't have any like dry patches because I do have like combination oily skin uh, mostly oily though um, and then an eye cream that I got from Kiehl's is their creamy eye treatment with avocado this is really cool like for some reason the texture of it is just like really nice to feel and it like feels really good on your eyes and I've come to the conclusion that I'm actually like getting a little bit old like I feel like I'm getting wrinkles and I just I don't know I look too closely in my magnifying mirror and then I just get a little bit depressed 
So yeah, I've been do I've been using that and I feel like it helps at least to be doing something. So that's what I do to kind of take care of my skin. If you guys want a full skincare routine, I can definitely do that because I just love skincare. I always wash my face. I never skip a night. That's one of my other tricks that I do. Um, but I got a lot of questions on my foundation and I actually have been using the same foundation for a long time actually. And it's the NARS Sheer Glow in Tahoe. Um, I know a lot of people use this. Like people in person will ask me like, oh, what foundation are you wearing? Like they go to the max store like, oh my God, I love your makeup. And I'm like, oh, wow thank you like seriously wow me like oh my god honestly I get that excited about it because I used to have really bad acne and now my skin's clear and I'm just like oh my god I'm just thankful every day of my life so I use the NARS Sheer Glow and then I'm also using the Clinique Even Better SPF 15 makeup which is good because I live in California and it's sunny pretty much all year long so I just combine both of these together they're a little bit of a different color so I kind of get my perfect match with them but I promise you this will make your skin look gorgeous and glowy I can also do a makeup routine because a lot of you guys have asked for that too and I want to do these videos if you guys want to see them so make sure to leave me a comment down below if you guys want to see them also my hair is another big topic okay so I want to show you guys the two products I, I've used these for a while too but I love them and I don't think I've ever talked about them so this is by Lush it's the Cynthia Sylvia stout shampoo and it's actually like it has beer in it I think I mean honestly it sounds pretty weird but the people at Lush told me that and um, it has lemons and cognac I'm not sure what that does but lemons are supposed to increase the shine and like get all the grime and grit out of your hair so like this is good for like those days when you really need to like clarify because it's really gonna take out all that stuff and since I've been working out all the time, I can like sometimes get away with like three days without washing if you use this. I started using this, um, not every time I wash my hair, but like mm, every other time maybe. It's the Paul Mitchell Supercharged Moisturizer. Yeah. And like this is one of those things that's like super great reviews on Amazon. Um, I bought it like in store, like at this little beauty store. But I really do like it. And um, I really like it because it's the only other conditioner I feel like actually does something for my hair. Like I've used the Moroccan oil, I hate that. And I'm allergic to the macadamia one. So this is something that I can use, I'm not allergic to, but I tend to only put it on the ends because it is kind of like rich and heavy. So yeah, that's my hair secret right there. There you go, there you go guys. Um, but yeah, it's definitely hard to maintain your hair when you're like working out all the time. So it's been a struggle, but we're hanging on, we're hanging on guys. And also um, smelling good is a struggle. So let's segue into my next favorite that is my Gucci Guilty perfume oh, okay my roommate I okay my roommate actually uses this and I would always smell it she would spray it before she left and I was like oh oh like it just smells so good like it almost has like a baby powder scent but not like it's not the baby powder scent trust me it's just like good like it's just like sexy woman any time of year like you could wear this in the winter or even the summer like um oh my god so I can't get through my workouts without a workout playlist and mine is on Spotify. Check it out. It's called Now This and I actually added Brandon's new song. I'm not sure how to say his last name so I'm not going to say it but it's called So Bad and I just added it to my playlist and it comes on and I'm like who is this? And I'm like oh my god he's so amazing. So download his new song. It's really good. Trust me. He doesn't even know I'm saying this about him but I just love the song so definitely go download it. I'll leave the link down below um, and you can tell him that I said that in this video and then maybe he'll notice me. Yeah. Really quick, my favorite new TV show, um, I watched American Horror Story and I talked about this on Twitter so if you're not following me there you can go there because I talk about all the stuff that I like that happens. I just talk about everything on Twitter. Um, so I watched episode, no, I watched season one. I love that. Season two, Asylum, I didn't really like. Season three, eh, and I hadn't got past that. But I really wanted to see the one with Emma Roberts. So I watched Coven, but I didn't think it was that good. But why is it in my favorites video? Because I just, I just like the first season a lot. And I think if you want to watch a season, that's the season to watch. I still have to watch Hotel. because Some of you guys said you loved it. So I'm gonna watch it. Another favorite is just my life. I am just loving life right now. I'm just so happy. Like everything is just going so great and I'm just super thankful for everything and all of you guys like truly, honestly guys, I just love everything about my life. I'm having such a good time here in California. It was just, I don't know, it's been great and I've just been trying to be very positive and like, I'm, it's kind of like I have a whole new life. Like it's really great. So um, I encourage you guys to do things that are scary and try new things and just, you know, get out of your comfort zone. So those are my favorites. If you guys stayed till the end, thank you so much. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe because you made it this far. So you probably like me maybe a little bit, like maybe. So I will talk to you guys in my next video and you can catch me on social media. Until then, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.